The school year may be over for many, but the need to feed children is not. Almost 30 million students in this country receive free or reduced price meals during the school year. And when school is out, these kids often go hungry. Jade Leah Burns joins us now in the studio with more about local programs designed to keep kids eating healthy all summer long. Jade. Sean, it isn't just about missing a meal. Hunger can have long-term harmful effects on a child. While many people may only look to schools for education, schools also play a vital role in providing nutrition for students. Sometimes their lunch can be the only real meal kids get. So what happens during the summer months? Experts say there's a spike in the need. Well, there are a lot of supports coming out of COVID um, and now that things are starting to dry up, those grants and things are, are no longer available. According to feedthechildren.org, research shows that summer hunger and food insecurity can cause physical and mental health problems, which leads to poor performance in class when school begins again. Northwest Tri-County Intermediate Unit 5 has been providing free meals through their summer food service program for decades. IU5 has 25 different sites where they deliver breakfast, snacks, and lunch. During the COVID years, we were serving over 110,000 meals. Um, and so, you know, our average, I think, is usually about 65,000. Um, and so, you know, we, we have some sites that are going to be getting at least 2,000 meals a week. Another organization that provides resources for families is the United Way of Erie County through their 211 program. We kind of think of this as like the social service equivalent to 911. One. Um, you know, you can just call that number uh, and you can talk to someone who's trained to, to treat you with respect, um, who has access to these resources and can help you find the pathway to, to help uh, that you need. United Way launched the 24-7 free service in Erie County in May of 2017. Jero Sevich also explains their community schools partnerships are beginning to expand services year-round. For all those programs, we have meals and snacks built into those. So it's another resource where um, you know, we're really trying to capitalize on that community school model um, to wrap services and supports around students and their families, um, not just the learning. All children under 18 can qualify for IU5's program regardless of income level. If you would like more information on locations and times, you can visit our website at yourerie.com. Sean. And Jade Leah Burns reporting tonight.